it's really um, emphasizing the commonalities of which we're trying to measure and achieve for our students and then working from there. Well, why not have activities and, and programs that give students a realistic sense of what it's gonna take? We're providing opportunities for students to have um, integrated learning that's not siloed into different subject areas. Allowing teachers to focus on that goal, to know exactly what they're expected to do and how to measure it, and then be innovative and creative on how they will approach it, and really to have districts to want to encourage and feed that innovation. Everything does not come in one flow. You're gonna have to do something. You might have to go back and then fix it and then go forward again. It helps me when I'm like doing things hands-on and like in science, it'd be easier with me with a team because we have multiple things to do and one person won't be able to do it all in the short amount of time that we have. Well, what I would like for Isa for her education will be for her to exceed as much as he can in whatever she wants to do. And uh, I'm here to help her and back her up. That's the way that I can. STEM is allowing her to uh, take that passion to the next level, so I think uh, that's what I want my kids to take up and uh, be able to succeed. The way that they're focusing on her math and science, I think this is the best way to help her with her challenges through, because the science and the math will be the hardest part about it. Getting the confidence to, to know that I can be an engineer or a scientist and know that at a very early age that it's, it's just an open option. It's, it's not a, a, a closed opportunity that only a select uh, group of students. Every young person has an opportunity to be an engineer or scientist if that's what they choose to be. I believe that there's no uh, difference in capability between men and women and we should just continue to encourage women to participate in science and math because um, we need their perspectives as well. Looking at her, I inspired a lot and started my career again. Girls are literally kind of kind of pushed away when the guys do all this stuff, but when boys and girls collide in a way with the education, it's way more easier because they can get help from both sides. A broader voice from 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 the Latino community, the African American community, the Native American community, the Pacific Islander community, uh, really makes business stronger. It makes uh, a product stronger and better. I'd like to be able to take a product the entire way. So go from idea to developing it, to experimenting it, to come up, uh, coming up with a solution, then perfecting it, and then commercializing it. ISA has had this wonderful opportunity to experience all the facets of STEM within an instructional setting, as well as have the opportunity every month to get out into the real world and experience STEM and see how what she's learning in school transpires into a field of work. The blending of Common Core and the Next Gen, I think, really have done successfully uh, for, for our state. 